her plus her banger banger what's up guys welcome back to my channel What's up? Stop. What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Taylor. If this is your first time here, welcome, welcome, welcome. Today, we're going to do a video. We're getting today, we're going to do a video about the fragrances that I have been absolutely loving. It has been a little bit of push and pull with the weather sometimes. It's hot sometimes it's cold sometimes I'm like oh spring is coming and then other times the weather's like no reel it back we're still in winter we're still in the thick of things let's just relax so these next few fragrances that I'm gonna show you some you've seen before some are new so you haven't it's just what I've been feeling what I've been vibing with what's been really good for me especially with this change of weather change of atmospheric vibe if you will my first one a very dear friend of mine gifted me this. I got Delina, you guys. I got Delina and I'm so glad that I got the trial size because I've heard so many good things about it, but I wasn't really sure how I would love it. You know what I'm saying? And Delina is one, baby, it, it costs a mint, but I'm telling you, this fragrance smells so good. So. If you haven't smelled it before, it's a more floral scent. It's a more sophisticated scent. It's not my favorite when I just smell it from the nozzle, but when it dries on my skin, oh, I'm in love and it lasts so long, you guys, so long. And it very well should, given that price point, it very well should. So Delina, day or night. Night, she's giving you sexy, girly, womanly daytime she's giving you sexy businesswoman sexy it just gives you a very sophisticated sexy scent in my opinion um every time i wear it i do get compliments a lot of people tend to like it as well so you might want to put that one on your radar next up guys i have been gushing over this since i bought the discovery pack it is by rito's gypsy water I did decide to buy it in the full size bottle. I think this was a gift for myself for Christmas. Ooh, look at it with my nails. So cute, so cute. But <laughs> I'm dealing with the dog while I'm here. So we got one here, one there. Moving on. Gypsy water. It's good. It's good. I like this one because it is a more unisex scent. It doesn't matter the weather outside. You just get a very clean yet earthy, um, eclectic scent from this. It does last a while, which of course we appreciate. Um, I've definitely put a dent in it, as you can see. So if you want to know more about the other scents that Byrito has to offer, I will put a link to a video up above, but just know that all of their fragrances smell so unique. So up front, you can smell the layers. I, they're just so complex and I love them to death. And Gypsy Water is my girl, my go-to girl when I don't know what to wear during day, during night, she's it. For nighttime, I have really been loving this. This was a gift to me. It is Carolina Herrera's um i want to say special edition i think it was called red or something i'm sorry i don't remember the name and i'm looking on the bottle it just says new york i know that's not the name well anyways the red bottle it smells so good it's giving you sweet yet sensual i got spray in the air again and there's some florals in there but when it dries down on me, I tend to smell very sweet, which I like. Um, this is definitely a sophisticated scent, um, but not like super. I'd say you still get like girly flirty with this one. This one I like to wear when I go out at night. Mm. Mm. This was obviously a blind buy for the person who bought it for me. My dad bought it for me. He knows I love fragrances. And 
and it was a winner. He bought me the other special edition one, the black one with the little uh, glitter at the bottom, and this is another another banger. And this gives you a different feel. So if you like Carolina Herrera, Carolina Herrera, however you say the child, the woman's snack, please check out all the scents because they all smell quite different in my opinion not me having a little bottle of gypsy water like i didn't just show you guys <laughs> so the next thing that i have been loving is oak the perfume oil it is always the base for when i want to bring something down so gypsy water is uh quite clean it gives you a little bit of earthy but if i want to bring out more of that woodsy feel i definitely put oak on prior to it just makes all your fragrances last longer and the mix just gives it a really nice a really nice balance if you will it's a beautiful combo with all the fragrances that i've been wearing speaking of like woodsy scents or bringing scents down of course we have ebony wood you guys i have been going through this bottle do you see this i didn't buy this that long ago i truly didn't but this smell i'm just telling you i don't know if i would be the type to wear it in the summer the spring the summer months i do believe this is a more well you know i don't know but in my opinion this reminds me a lot of the colder months it reminds me a lot of fall a lot of winter i think this one will be a more seasonal fragrance for me but on those colder days i have been reaching for her plus her banger her plus her banger banger okay um ebony woods is that girl stand alone add her to something else she's that girl she's gonna make your scent maybe in the summer i will mix her with other scents like the gypsy water like i've been doing but um, i don't think i will wear her by herself in the warmer months but just know that right now she's still that girl still that girl okay i need to stop playing and buy the bigger bottle these next fragrances i have purchased from royalty scents if you don't know what royalty scents is it is a subscription service so that you can buy more higher in more perfumery um fragrances and you can buy tester tubes as you can see here and you can basically try before you buy now these guys these i just I got tired of buying fragrances blind and hating them. So for the more higher end fragrances, I think the subscription service is so necessary for people like me, for fragrance freaks like myself. Um, so let's get into the ones that I actually have been picking all good ones. I love them all, but let's get into the ones that I've been vibing with right now. So this first one is Alexandra... Alexander J. I don't know this brand, so forgive me if this is like just an abbreviation since it's on a small bottle, but it's called Morning Mus. Morning Mux. Musks. Morning Musks. <laughs> I'm so ugly. This, y'all. It's like musky, but in a subtle way. And it's more of a light and airy musk it's just she's that girl for day or night in my opinion um it's just like enticing i really love morning musk so this one royalty scents i'm glad i picked it sometimes i pick things just because the bottle is cute um yeah but that one was actually a good a good pick next up from royalty scents i got Le Lebeau, Santel 33. Adore her. Adore her. A woodsy scent, but very much different than Ebony Wood. Ebony Wood gives me, I don't know what kind of wood, you know, they use for these things. But this gives me more of like a sandal wood, like a lighter, lighter toned wood. Um, I love her by herself as well as in combo with many other fragrances ebony woods gives me more 
Now, mind you, I don't know how these woods smell, but this is just what I think of, like a more mahogany wood, a deeper wood, a darker wood. So this daytime, nighttime, you can't go wrong. It smells very fresh. This is a type of fragrance that hotels use on their linens. They have uh, little reed oil diffusers. You know, this is the go-to girl for hotels. I really like it on my clothes. So I, if you haven't watched my previous videos, you wouldn't know, but I have bought a Santal it's not it's called Santal but it's not by Le Beau, but it's from Amazon it's an oil you can put it in a diffuser which I love to do because I love my atmosphere to smell like this this is how clean and how lovely it smells I also like to put a few drops on my they're like wool balls dryer sheet balls um, I put a few drops on there and my clothes come out smelling they come out smelling so so good so I recommend Santal 33 for your body, for your home, for everything, baby. I could just swim in Santal 33. Okay, my next scent is from Le Beau as well. This one is actually called Bergamot 22. Bergamot, if you haven't smelled it, it's a very citrusy, fresh type of smell. And the way Le Beau has done it, Oh, I just love it. I just love it. So those days that I'm feeling really giddy, really hyper, really bubbly, I like to put this on because it just kind of reflects my inner aura. Bergamot 22, just so fresh, so bright, so cheerful. Um, if you want to be in a good mood, it's a good one to spray. If you didn't know, I was really once into essential oils like really into them so we got all these essential oils and bergamot was always my favorite and if you look and see the benefits of bergamot it's always supposed to create a brighter uh, atmosphere so if you want to be productive if you want to be more energetic that's what bergamot is used for that's what it exudes so to have it in a perfume in a fragrance form chef's kiss i love it so much okay, lastly but surely not least i have been loving a bond number no. nine fragrance and it is hudson yards i need a reminder though oh hudson yards it smells green to me it smells a tad floral i get a lot of citruses um Hudson Yards is oh hold on hold on hold on Hudson Yards is like the perfect daytime scent I'm thinking sun I'm thinking bright I'm thinking playful flirty you know what I'm saying that's the vibes that I get from bond number no. nine's Hudson Yards I love to wear it sometimes I forget about it so I have to make a conscious effort to reach for it just because let's be honest gypsy water has been stealing the show but I also love this Hudson Yards. I just forget just because I'm so used to reaching for the same bottle every day. You know, not every day, but most days I'm used to reaching for the same bottle. But all in all, Hudson Yards just smells super good. For most of these, if you haven't noticed, I'm more of a cleaner, earthy type of girl. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of these scents, although quite different, give me the same vibe the same aura the same frequency <laughs> fragrances are like super therapeutic for me they just really help me put intention towards what my day what my night is going to look like what i want it to look like um look at me getting all woo woo it's kind of a form of manifestation if you will like oh i want to be bright and airy i want to be flirty i want to have energy i'm gonna spray this bergamot 22. oh i'm gonna be bright but i'm gonna be sophisticated i'm gonna be a little more subdued today so let me go ahead and spray this santal 33. you know what i'm saying like how you want to feel, 
how you want to look, how you want to be perceived, how you want to present yourself is also tied very much into what you wear. Not just clothing, but, but what people smell. Make you an experience, okay? You're gonna see me, you're gonna smell me, you're going to get this vibe off rip. Before I even speak, you know what I'm about. You know what I'm on. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I think too much into fragrances. Maybe I'm just a little too excited about these, but that's me. <laughs> so guys, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Let me know down below what fragrances you have been vibing out to. I'm really curious. I know that there are so many other fragrances out there that I want to smell. So if you drop some down below, you know, that can kind of narrow my initial search for what else I want to get into. I will catch you guys in the next one. Love you all. Bye.